Hey guys, Steve with Mostly Snakes. Uh, we're going to do another feeding video for you. Uh, it was brought to my attention from Bobby that I needed to get a little closer to the snake during feeding. So we'll try to improve that right now. First we have Magara, who is a motley golden child. And of course she's hungry. You notice the darker pattern, which is the motley. The golden child, which is the lack of the pattern. So uh, we'll try to get a little better at naming off the morphs here. All right, let's go with Odessa. Again, all of my snakes get pre-killed. It is much better for the snake. You don't have any kind of threat of getting hurt. This here is an orange glow, and she is really hungry. Uh, actually, an orange glow tiger. Uh, beautiful snake. Never, uh, never a weak feeding response. All right, we're going to go with Phoebe next. Phoebe is a platinum. And uh, to me, a, a beautiful snake. Now, she does like to come out of there pretty quick. Get inside. Now, you can see the pattern on her. Um... I absolutely love this morph. It's got a lot of yellows and grays on it. And uh, again, just a great eater. Next we have Penelope, which is one of my personal favorites. She is a pied, to be exact, a low white pied. My video man's just a little concerned about being close. You can see the white on her, especially on her underbelly. Just a beautiful snake. Let go of my hand now. <laughs> All right, next one we have Takara. She is a purple, let's see, purple albino tiger. And uh, again, she doesn't usually give me a whole lot of trouble when eating. She usually stays pretty hungry. And she's usually pretty gentle as well. Again, uh, purple albino tiger. All right, next in line is my, definitely my good eater. We have Giselle. Uh, usually eats with no problem at all. Giselle is a genetic stripe. And she's already hungry, right there, goofball. Love the genetic strip pattern. Uh, to me, this little part right here is just absolutely beautiful. And, uh, of course, I think all snakes are beautiful, so it doesn't matter. Next, Liam. Let me see what Liam gets. Liam gets a large as well. Let's see. Make sure we get him a good size one because he is a pretty good size male. Liam is a lavender albino, and he's usually a really good eater as well. There you go, big boy. Take it up. Nice, beautiful, clean pattern. Uh, again, that is a lavender albino. Brian, I hope this is doing better for you, uh, and I really do appreciate the criticism on the videos. Uh, it always helps me to get better and hopefully make you guys enjoy the videos a little better. Sophia is a large. Sophia is a super tiger. And of course she stays hungry as well. Again, the pattern on her is just beautiful. I love the yellows. Um, white on the bottom, just beautiful. Next we have Gordius. Gordius will get another large. Let's see. Where are my other larges? There it is. Kind of disgusting, right? All right. Gordius is a Sunfire genetic stripe. And he will shoot out of there. Oh, he shed last night, too. Good job, buddy. 
Good job. Now, when he gets done with that, we'll give him a good soaking. But you'll be able to see his, his colors are phenomenal. All right, next we have Svetlana. Svetlana is going to get a medium. And Svetlana is my other super tiger. She is really, really super flighty. She doesn't like being handled all that much. But she typically is a good eater. Beautiful pattern on her. Next we have Natasha. Natasha is a normal pattern, normal color phase retic. She is about, eh, I would say about eight months old. She is currently being treated for mites. Another beautiful pattern. How am I doing, Brian? <laughs> All right, next is Ivan. Ivan is called an ivory. Basically, when you put two platinums together, which was Phoebe, this is what you get. There you go, buddy. Yeah, good job. You can see the gray colors on him, too. All right, then we got Sheila. Again, Sheila is a Sunfire. Just a standard Sunfire, which happens to have great colors as well. You shed, too. Look at you. Good job, guys. I didn't even know she was in shed. All right. Now, one of my favorites. We have Telephus. Telephus is a titanium super tiger. And he shed. Good God. Awesome. All right, all right. Let me get this out of the way. All one piece, which means the humidity has really been uh, right on the money with him, which makes me happy. Uh, Panzer is over here, so we'll skip him for a minute. Cetera, this is a Sunfire Motley. You'll notice that the pattern is a little darker, and it is also brought up close to the top. You see the Sunfire on the tail which is usually the indicator. Uh, beautiful snake in my opinion as well. Uh, let's see, Gabby. Good old Gabrielle. Gabrielle is a golden child and she's hungry as well. Take it. There you go. Love the golden childs. Uh, to me, the lack of pattern is just beautiful. All right, now let's do Panzer. Panzer is a purple golden child. Oh, Panzer! Good boy! Again, just about all of my snakes do really good as far as feeding response. It's hard to find a retick without one to be honest. All right, now, who gets my jumbos? Yumi. Let's see, Yumi needs to be fed from. This girl here has been kind of off and on on her feeding. I really think she went through a cycle this spring, so she came off the food a little bit. But uh, let's see if she'll take one today. She might be done for today, so she doesn't appear to want it, so we'll try her again here in a little bit. My other jumbo would be Garrus. Garrus is a golden child tiger. Typically a great, great feeder. Yeah, he doesn't have any issues. Uh, the tiger, from what I understand, is these little marks on the side. If I'm wrong with that, please correct me. 
I'm learning with these morphs just like everybody else, so uh, I don't pretend to be a total pro at this. Uh, let's see, I believe with Liam. Yeah, Liam just shed, so we'll give him a good meal. Liam is my proven breeder. He is a platinum, just like Phoebe. So you can tell the yellows and the grays. He usually does really good with the feeding. Yup. Again, a beautiful snake. He's about 13 feet and uh, never has a problem with eating. All right. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put you on pause here. I got another one that I'm gonna attempt to give its first rabbit. So uh, once I get that ready, we'll go back on and uh, we'll see what it is.